So the second step is the same as it is. So we are going to change the third step R3 minus 2 R2. So what is your R3? R3 is 0 minus 6 minus 4. And 2 times of R2 is 0. So here minus 6. And this is 2 times of this means you are getting a minus 4. Okay. So if you multiply this one means you will get the value all the entries are 0. So if all the entries are 0 means so what you going to write the rank of the matrix so the last equivalent matrix how many non-zero rows are there so first one second one so only the two non-zero rows are there this is a zero row so we are taking a rank of it has it has two non-zero rows So row of A is equal to 2. What is the row of A? So this is nothing but the rank of a matrix. Okay. Rank of a matrix A is equal to 2. Rank of a matrix A is equal to 2. The similar way we can apply for the every problem. Here we are having a 3 by 3 matrix. So if you want you can be change it for any other matrix also. We can apply the same method till our aim to find out the non-zero rows. How many non-zero rows are there. Okay. So similarly we are going to see for the another example. Stop. Anima. Okay. 